What's up, you guys? My name is Destiny Dove, and if you're a new or a subscriber, welcome back. This hair that I'll be using is from the company called iShow, and I've actually already reviewed this wig, so I'll leave the original video down in the description box, but you already know what this video is about. I'm going to show you how to spice up your unit by using just some water, a rat tail comb, and some flexi rods. I will be using probably two out of the five different sizes that I have here, but if you're interested, keep on watching. All right, so as you can see here, I am just using my spray bottle to dampen up the hair. You wanna make sure that you evenly spread the water out throughout the hair because this will really help the curls not only stay longer, but when you are using the flexi rods, this will help the hair nicely wrap around the rod. Once you get the hair nice and wet, you want to take your comb and just carefully comb out the hair just to make sure that there are no tangles and that each strand of hair is going the same way. This isn't mandatory, but I find it best to use some form of leave-in conditioner. You want to use a generous amount and spread it evenly around the hair. This will not only lock in the curls once you coil them, but it will also help activate the hair to, you know, form some type of curly texture. And I find it best to, you know, use leave-in conditioner because it really helps mold the unit into whatever you want when styling. the hair is nice and conditioned you want to make sure that you start constructing your parts how do you want your curls to come out the way you part the hair is the way the curls are going to form so I wanted my curls to be symmetrical on each side so as you can see here I parted both sides and to ensure that the hair does not unravel you want to take the end of the hair and carefully wrap it around the flexi rod as you're doing so you want to overlap the hair in the beginning just like that and as you do that you want to make sure that as you are wrapping up the flexi rod all the hair are going the same direction another thing to keep in mind is how much hair you're using around the flexi rod because flexi rods come in different sizes, you have to be mindful of how much hair you are putting on it. This will affect the results of how the curls come out. You want to make sure that you put enough amount of hair on the flexi rod, but not too much so that each flexi rod can dry evenly and give you the best results.
the flexi rods I ended up using. As you can see in the front, we have the blue flexi rods, which were more of like on the smaller scale. And then I went in the back with the purple ones just to give it a more of like voluminous finishing look. Once you let the hair sit overnight, you want to carefully, and I mean carefully, unravel the curls. If you did it correctly, the curls should come out looking something like this, and the flexi rod should not, you know, be hard to take out. It should almost slide off on its own. If you are having troubles or you are, you know, a little hesitant to do so, it helps if you dampen your fingers or if you put a little bit of oil on your fingers to help moisten the hair. And yeah, so as you can see here, I'm just carefully taking out the flexi rods. And once you do so, you want to play around with the curls. You want to carefully spread them apart, fluff them out, and make them, you know, nice to your liking. you guys so this is what your curls should look like straight out of you know taking them out of the flexi rods you should get these nice tight and bouncy curls like I said before you want to spread them out and make them you know nice and fluffy and customize it to your liking once you do so you should get something like this and as you can tell from my face you guys I was very pleased on how everything turned out the curls were nice and tight and very defined and bouncy after me manipulating it and playing with it everything still came out really really well if you want more information or if you just want to check out this company for yourself i will leave all the information down in the description box please continue to support your girl by liking and subscribing i literally cannot do this without you guys and i really appreciate the views and the comments and all the feedback that you guys continue to give me each and every video that i upload once again my name is destiny dove and i will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching ciao